in this video we are going to see the rc transient response for a step input so for that we need the step as the input so that we will take from the signal voltage source so in the signal voltage source part we will take the step voltage as the input so we will place this step voltage in the workspace then we will tell select the resistor value as 1 kilo ohm I will say select resistor 1 kilo ohm resistor value then we will place the capacitor as a 10 microfarad so capacitor is a 10 microfarad in addition to that we have the ground from the basic source we can select the power source we can select the ground so these are the necessary components now connect all the components in a serious manner connect all the components in series manner so resistor capacitor and the uh, pulse input voltage and they are connected with the ground now let us set the values uh, in the simula in the simulation tab we can set the in the left side we have the transient uh, option there we can select the initial condition the left side we have the transient uh, right so with that we have set the initial as set as zero and the start time is uh, 0 and the end time is let us take uh, 0 0.01 so here in the output we can set, set as voltage now uh, we, we also need to st set the step voltage initial value is 0 final value is 10 and the starting time is 0 now the diagram is ready let us run this diagram by so here we have the out, output time is uh, 10 milliseconds we have the output so slightly we can change the time as uh, let us take a 0 0.5 0 0.5 so here uh, when we run the diagram uh, we have the some output we cannot uh, get some information from this graph so we will set a uh, once again change the time as uh, let us take a 0.1 now once again we run the diagram so here we have some accurate graph from this we can get some value so let us change the background color in the cursor tab we can select the show cursor we have the cursor point sliding point uh, to some extent we know the time constant for any rc circuit is 63.2 percentage of the maximum value so we will set a 6.32 so approximately we can get the time as uh, 10 milliseconds as the time constant so thank you all